Okay, here we have a Google Nexus 1. So let's go ahead and take a look at Happy Peg running on this, built using Flash CS5. So go ahead and start the app, pull it up from the applications list. As you can see, it's pretty responsive. Go ahead here and play a quick game. You can see the timer up in the top right updating in real time. Uh, I didn't win that game. And here's the different screens. We have the settings screen, a couple of settings you can choose, the how to play screen in case you're new to it, and finally the about screen. Okay, that's the Google Nexus One. Now here's the same app running on an iPhone 3GS. This was developed back in February and is available on the App Store right now. So you can see same UI, same gameplay. Again, you you may notice this the timer up in the top right is a little bit bigger. Resolution on the iPhone is a is uh, about the same physical screen size but the resolution is lower. So there you go, the iPhone 3GS. And here's the code and the actual application inside Flash CS5. And that's it. So there you have it. You can use Flash CS5 to develop mobile applications for Android and iPhone with little to no coding changes. And uh, so yeah, there you go.